Hi everyone, welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video Skin Tags, Moles, Warts, Hyperpigmentation on the Skin. Today I'm going to share a natural homemade remedy with you that you can use to get rid of all of these issues. Now I'm using all natural ingredients. This is 100% homemade and you're going to whip this up in the kitchen. Now if you have hanging warts, it's going to get rid of those warts by shrinking it. It's basically going to kill the root of the wart and before you know it, they're going to be falling off. If you have molds on the skin, it's going to slowly fade those molds away. Also the hyperpigmentation. So if you're interested in today's video, continue watching. Skin Tag Remedy Now what is Skin Tag? Skin tags is a small flap of tissue that hangs off the skin by a connecting stalk. Skin tags are not dangerous. They are usually found on the neck, chest, back, armpit, under the breast, or in the groin area. Now let's move on to our recipe. Now here I have the two main ingredients that I'm gonna use in this recipe. The first one is petroleum jelly. And petroleum jelly is also known as Vaseline in many countries. Now petroleum jelly is a wonderful ointment for the skin. When you use petroleum jelly on your skin tag, it's gonna to have to soften it. This is gonna to have to shrink those tags and eventually they're just gonna get swivel up and dry and fall off. Now, the next ingredient is banana. And banana is known for getting rid of skin tags. Not the flesh of the banana, but the peel of the banana. I'm also gonna use an optional ingredient, and this is tea tree oil. And tea tree oil has antibacterial and antimicrobial properties, which is great to get rid of skin tags. Now, the reaction between the Vaseline and the banana peel with the tea tree oil is gonna create a very powerful remedy for getting rid of your skin tag. So, to begin, here I already have some banana peel and you want to use banana peel like this. You do not want to use the green one. You want to make sure it is ripe, fully, fully ripe and then we are going to peel. Now we are going to just scrape the inner part of the banana peel since that's really the part with the active iron and all of that good stuff that's going to help to get rid of the skin tags. Now you do not need a lot so we're just going to take a little of the banana peel like this right here. And I'm just gonna chop this. No need to put a little bit of peel like this in the blender. Just blend or crush, put it in a plastic wrapper and just crush it really, really fine so that it can be spreadable, okay? So as you can see, it's very dark. That's from the iron. Banana peel is filled with iron. However, it do have a lot of nutrients in it that is beneficial to the skin. Banana peel is good for lightening the skin. Also, banana peel is a wonderful remedy for whitening in the teeth and it is also great for getting rid of skin tags and molds as we're going to be doing in this recipe. Now the banana peel is ready and this is it. So now we're going to move this to a container. So we're going to put this in and this is about a tablespoon of banana peel. So I'm going to use about the, um, the same amount of petroleum jelly. I'm going to use about one tablespoon of petroleum jelly. We're gonna add this to the banana peel. Now you can go ahead and you could mix these two together. However, if you have the optional ingredient, which is the tea tree oil, you're gonna take a little, just about three drops, and you're good to go. And now we're gonna blend, okay? Just slowly fold this banana peel in your Vaseline. Slowly fold it in the petroleum jelly. And this is what it should look like. Just blend it in. It's gonna be creamy. You wanna mix this well, okay? You really wanna mix it well, so don't rush it, just mix well. Now, this is what it should look like after you finish mixing. Now this is not ready guys. What you're gonna do with this, you are gonna put this away for 24 hours at least so that all the minerals and vitamins and all the wonderful properties of the banana peel can infuse in the petroleum jelly to create this remedy for getting rid of your skin tag. Now after 24 hours and this is nicely infused, this is now ready to use 
on your skin tags and also if you have moles or spots and blemishes on the skin now this is pretty easy to use as it is now spreadable so to use it you're just gonna take a little of it and you're gonna apply it to wherever you have and look at this this is actually blended nicely in the skin wherever you have your skin tags if you have a large patch or skin tags all over your body just apply it like I show you here all over the skin now if you have hanging tags you're gonna take a little and you're gonna apply it to the hanging tags now check this out what you're gonna do when you place it over that hanging tag you're just gonna circle it like this with the treatment make sure to get to the root and just round and round and round and round and that hanging tag no need to cover with a band-aid as it's gonna totally blend on the tag now before you know it what is gonna happen with the hanging tag you're gonna notice that it start to shrink it's not just gonna fall off like that it's gonna Gonna get like very small shivling up shivling up that is the treatment killing the root of the tag and then it's gonna totally dry up and one day you're just gonna wake up and the skin tag has fallen off now use the treatment as often as you can until your skin tags fall off or if you're using it on molds until they fade now if you're using this and spots and blemishes which this is also great for fading dark spots wear it for about six to seven hours rinse off with some warm water now for storage you can choose to store this in the refrigerator for about 15 days or you can leave it on the countertop for about seven days it's not gonna go bad because the vaseline helped to preserve the banana peel okay all right so there you have it thank you all for watching if you like the video give it a thumbs up that way i know you like the video also leave your comments your questions and if this was the first time watching i'm sure you want to see more of this video in order to do so look below you're going to see the word subscribe just click on it and you will be subscribed also at the side there's a bell if you click on that you will get a notification as soon as i upload the video thank you all for watching and i'll see you in my next video Bye bye